And this is what happened. We found a wild girl out in the uh, wilderness, and she joined us. We're friends now. Oh, joy. Please don't make a habit out of collecting half-naked women in our castle. I mean, I would love to have that as a habit. She needed our help. That and she may yet turn out to be useful. I mean, she is very strong. Oh, hear, hear. This youngster speaks the truth. You shouldn't shun such occasions, dear boy. There are many more to come, and you need to make the best of it. What do you mean? As you grow in prestige, powerful individuals may cling to your presence. You would be wise to include them in your inner circle. Temper their trust into an asset, and you will surpass every obstacle. No. Meh. What now, Grandfather? One way or another, you seem to have grasped the basics of what it means to be a ruler. The long journey, however, only begins. Crucy? What? Ah, yeah, that's the name of the uh, debt collector. Aye, him and more. This debt cannot be settled overnight. If he is to keep a tight leash on your kingdom, we need to entice him with a prospect. A prospect of growth. Can we talk to the, um, the gnome that my sister met in the last episode? But fear not. After all, you have me. Not very reassuring. I can offer you guidance, you know. Experience and the direction that comes with it. Set your goals. Focus your attention. It's better to work towards something concrete, don't you think? I mean, doesn't filling the castle with half-naked women count as something concrete? I suppose you're right. Well, let's see. Your objectives for the next two months shall be... Ooh. So I have to complete the following objectives. Three kingdom quests. Got it. Alright. So I'm guessing I have to go to the tavern and maybe the fountain and get some quests from there. And possibly one over here from the castle. Deadlines and priorities. Alrighty then, so we need to do these before the timer runs out. This concludes our little series of walls of, of text. Thank you. I will not try I will try to not screw up. Thank you very much. Alright. We have unlocked Kingdom Quests. And we have a party level up. New perk slot unlocked. Your companions grow stronger. Sweet. So, let's fill this up with a perk. So, as Griffith is going to be sort of our tank character, I'm thinking we're going to give him some more vitality. Done. And maybe... Initiative or Brawler? I'm going to go with Brawler. It's going to be a in-your-face kind of tank. And that is it. What about K? He is gonna be a support slash skirmisher. So I'm thinking brawler and initiative. Done. Can I swap these out? If I yeah, so I can like uh depending on the situation, swap that out. I need to find trinkets to sort out. Also, Signy is gonna be Brawler and initiative as well. Actually, brawler and health as well. Is that all? I'm, I saw something when I was here last time. If I select Signy, it says 100 RP to the next level. So does that mean I can unlock this? Because of my choices in the uh, battle last time or something? How do I unlock that? Because this is 0 RP. And this is still locked. So 100 RP should mean that the rank should be um, able to uh, get upgraded. Odd. But let's leave that and try to find ourselves some of these uh, quests, shall we? Let's check out our... Oh, Jesus! That is a lot of quests. We have dungeoneering quests, we have construction quests, inhabitants, experience, crafting, and activity. So these are sort of like achievements as well. But we need to complete three quests in 51 days. That should be uh, pretty easily. Let's uh, 
check regular quests. Nothing better than expected. So nothing new there. All right, let's talk to Griffith. Run! If I may, young master, I'd like to talk to you about your combat technique. Would you like to spend the day with Griffith? Hmm, sure. Excellent, let us proceed. So are we gonna have like a uh, duel? It's been some time since you participated in prolonged combat, young master. I mean, kinda like yesterday? Let us spar! Okay, I'm ready! Ha! Splendid! But there's always room for improvement, is there not? Whoa! Well, you do know your basics, that much is certain. So hopefully I'm gonna get, um... Uh, relationship points with this? Ready for another go? Haha, you -ha, like that! Ah, excellent! Now, strike again! I would like to... Now he's holding his sword arm in the right position, so I'm gonna go with a strike from the left. Was that the left? I, I guess it was your left in the backhand sword position. Well done! Continue. Con continue. Oh, you paired one! Good job, Griffith. And I think I got some RP with him. Days left, 50. So our personal bonds have grown stronger. Okay. Can I unlock this? Oh, I'm acquaintance now. We unlocked skill morphs. Uh, morph perfect strikes. Sweet. So can I like equip that or is that already equipped? I think you have to equip it. So maybe we'll unlock brawler and have perfect strike instead. Wait, I can't? Oh, it takes two. Hmm. Do I want perfect strikes? Pinpoint strike cannot miss or be dodged. What did pinpoint strike do again? Can I check that somewhere? Where is his abilities? I don't think I can check that in this menu. But let's see what it does next time. You are fine, you are fine. Done. We have completed one quest, right? I think. That, I think that was a quest because it was a um, exclamation mark. No, I don't want to spend any, any more time right now. But I did get a, a bunch of uh, RP from that. So maybe if I... What was the next rank? Let's see here. Personal Bonds. Unlocks perk, skilled fighter. 4% dodge. That's pretty good. I'll keep that in mind. And another more for the victory cry. Cool. Elaine, what you up to? I know things started off rough, but please don't give up. I have a good feeling about this. Any ideas on how we should proceed, Elaine? That's great! Uh, maybe invite some people? Let's get some more people! Sure, that's a good idea. What about you, Gwendolyn? Oh, joy. There's no place but up. Let's get building. She wants us to build a blacksmith shop. So I'm thinking town construction, and we have a uh, world map sort of thing there. Let's go check out the construction for the town. There is no cow level, thank you. All right, so we should have a few... Um, uh, construction materials from our adventuring. So maybe we'll build up a smithy. You first need to recruit Gunther. Okay, so I need to recruit people before I can build stuff. But I these are the things I can... Wait, can I upgrade placeholder in? I can! To level 2, but I don't have the materials. What about a merchant house? Unlocks Huxon the Merchant. But we haven't really met him with K yet. So maybe we should do that before we um, build that up. Hello, Huxun. I've come to introduce myself. Don't be shy, I'm open for business. What would you like to do? I would like to see what you have available. Thank you very much. So these are my things, I'm guessing. And these are his. So I could buy 
So maybe I should buy a trinket from him. Plus one duration of positive effects. I have 1100 DLC. Plus 15 shield points at each activation. That's pretty good. Hmm, maybe I'll buy one of these. Got a lot of good trinkets. Plus 80 shield points. So is that my, my, my maximum? Is there like a cap to the shield points and this increases it? Or is that a flat like 80? If it is a flat one, I might want to get it. Mm, I'm going to get this one though. More duration. I would like to buy one of the, these. Can I barter? No. And that is it. I was kind of hoping, kind of hoping you were going to introduce yourself, Aksun. So, Merchant House. Also, what is this? A pier. Interesting. Oh, so that's where we go to fish. I'm going to have to check that out. But build a merchant house. He sells crafting resources and buys any unneeded items. But what do I get from building the merchant house? I guess better a selection from Haksun. Sweet. And I can upgrade it later on. And that also increases our uh, reputation or re relationship ranks. Cool. Let's check out... Oh, hello, Signy, are you at the pier? I want to check that out, so might as well kill two birds with one stone. All fish you catch, double is consumable and concoctions. That's pretty sweet. And we can catch more than just fish. Interacting with the fishing tools on the pier will trigger the fishing day. So it consumes one day. Okay. That's sweet. Signy, what's up? The duckling approaches. He does! So I can spend a day with Signy as well. But I do want to make sure we get all these quests done. We do have like 50 days left. And getting her reputation up might be a good idea as well. Let's check if that increased, by the way. No, it's still at 100%. So let's spend a day with her. Approaches. Just so. Hey, I trust nothing's bothering you. You've been hanging out here a lot. I hope you had no problems adjusting to town life. These settlements of stone and wood are confusing. I think I agree with you. The trails of wooden cobble I mesh with less. These are, or there are smells and colors that confuse me, and I do not always wish to confront them. But this, this brings warmth. It mirrors familiar sights, and for that I'm grateful. It is indeed soothing. We fight so that we may achieve rest. We rest so that we may fight. To everything there is a season, and a time to every purpose under the heaven. Yes, 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 yes. Sure. How goes the search for your beast? <sighs> that face though. Not too well, I take it. No, and I hold no answers why. I will definitely help you find your beasts. I gave my word. A rare kindness. That made her happy. The ancestors are with us. Yes, they are. And we you will find your beasts in time. But I kinda wanna check out fishing while we're here. We have 48 days to go, and we gained another reputation level with Signy. We've unlocked instinctive emotions. Pounds no longer requires uh, the line spot to be within line of sight. That's pretty damn good. So do I have to do something to unlock a buddy with her maybe? Maybe unlock the uh, level 2 fishing spot? So let's go over to her, and I'm gonna actually get that. Because that seems like it was an issue last time. There we go. Shinji! I know nothing! What do you mean you came to talk? I would like to spend some time with you. Get to know you a bit better. Mmm. Mmm, that sounds great. Yeah, go on. 
look, Mr. Lauren, just in case, I'm not entirely sure what game you're playing, but I don't have any money. No offense. I'm not here for your money. I wonder if that means that was the, uh, like a middling thing, because when we did the, uh, the best choice, I think, there were three of those little arrows. So maybe that wasn't the best one. Wait, you're not planning to take advantage of me? That, that kind of sounded a bit lewd, but sure. I may be poor and smelly and toothless, but I've still got my pride, you know. What does a king want with a drunk like me? I just want to be friends! <laughs> Are you bothering our customers again, Shichi? Dude, really? <laughs> Dude, really? No, he's not bothering me. Don't mind us. We're just the, uh, a prince or a, a lord and his friend. I just wanted to get to know you. What an odd thing to say. What's there to know? And more importantly, why? Because of your sweet, sweet unlocks, my good friend. He's the guy who happened to fight alongside my dad doing some war. Why are they still friends? I'll never know. He's just there. Part of the family at this point, you know? I'd smile if my face were dumb. Aww. I wonder if he's like a, uh, his brother or something? Or maybe he like saved his life during the war? Or maybe even her grandfather. I don't think so. No drinking for you. Or maybe lots of drinking for you. It should have unlocked our tier 1 ability. Let's see. Chichi! An additional fishing attempt during a fishing day. Sweet. Now, can I check... Not Codex. And we gotta get the diplomacy going at some point. But how... I probably should have read the entirety of my... Uh, the tutorial there. So we've completed two. Of three. Let's go back here. And this time, we're gonna hang around with you guys. And once we have your tier 1 ability, we can use that to go adventuring and get the extra DLC from it. What can I get you? I would like something with a lot of meat. Actually, I'm gonna trust you guys and get today's special. That might be the best thing. Or not. Yes. Actually, great choice. Maybe she got really happy about that. Maybe the big up arrow is the best choice. So, how was it? It was all right. She liked that. Thanks. Good, good, good. Hey, Papa, the king boy liked your food. Ah, yeah. oh, he liked that too. Look at him. King boy? Gee. Ah, we had a nice meal over at the tavern, and we got a level up in relationship with Lilka and Bass. So we need to upgrade the tavern in order to unlock these. So that was, that's what this means. Which probably means I don't have to do that for these guys, because there's no lock there. Good to know. But we do get our plus 5% dialac, which is great. So, I want to get... Back to the castle, and we are gonna go adventuring, because we also unlocked a lot of maps when we um, unlocked the uh, kingdom quests. Venture forth with this party. Also, I'm, I can't wait to unlock all these guys. We should have a lot of options on where to go now. So, these are still locked. I guess I have to, like, unlock the adjoining um, nodes. So... Where's the one we already checked out? Has that been... Like... Wasn't... Was this the one? Thalgar Wood? Maybe it has, like, respawned by now. I actually want to check out... This place. Might be good farmland. Maybe we can get some good, uh, People there. And it's an easy difficulty dungeon. Might be a good fit for us right now. 
And enter. Welcome to Ban Macher. And I would like to enter this node first. Treading the slopes of the expanse, you bump into two lone huts overseeing a cliff. Farm animals graze in peace on a nearby pasture, looking around infrequently with fleeting curiosity. Two elderly gentlemen are seated by a small table in the yard, though the distance makes you unable to see what exactly they are doing. Approach the men. If it wasn't for the tangible sense of contest, you'd call them grandfatherly. Their rugged looks and tense faces only contribute further to that aura of uneasiness. The two gentlemen appear to be too busy to notice your presence, or they simply do not care, lost in their focus on what appears to be some sort of antiquated game board. I don't think they'll appreciate me trying to, um, get their attention, so quietly grab a chair and observe. Maybe I'll learn something. The game seems simple enough to understand after a handful of tr turns. 24 black pieces against 13 white pieces, locked in battle to death. Despite this inherent asymmetry, it doesn't strike you as one-sided. Among the white pieces, one appears considerably larger and more ornate, a commander unit of some sort. Appropriately, it never lingers in one place for long, constantly evading the aggressions of black. Slowly, the goal of the game becomes clear. The white commander has to flee the board, while black pieces have to capture said commander. As you've never played yourself, you have no idea how to gauge the skill of these two gentlemen. At the very least, they appear evenly matched. Keep watching. The game continues. A couple of bold maneuvers later, you begin to spot patterns in Black's strategy, and you can clearly see his movements and turns to come. White's commander's piece is walking into a trap. The upcoming turn will irre irreversibly decide the victor. Oddly enough, White doesn't seem to realize this. I'm not gonna ruin the fun for everyone. I am gonna not intervene. You stay completely silent. Move after move, the white steadily wraps his commander in peril. When he finally realizes he's been tricked, it's far too late. Defeat is but a turn away now. The black turtles heartily, reveling in the proverbial tears of his opponent. The game is in the bag. Later after the game, black chats you up clearly uplifted by his victory. Ha! Melv's good, but he completely dropped the ball on that one, he chuckles. But you noticed my roost, didn't you? Well then, thanks for not spoiling the fun! Yay! We got 50 XP, 50 Dialac, and a black horse piece. Plus 10% physical penetration. That also sounds kinda lewd. But I would like to equip that, thank you very much. Along with the uh, thing I bought for K, the copper badge, which increases positive uh, bonuses, and then maybe equip the physical trinket to Signy. Done. Next! Enter the combat node, the sleepy croplands. Looks like we're gonna fight some rats according to the text read there. The description. Survive for 8 turns, or a challenge to win the battle in 5. That is a lot of dudes. Let's... Oh, I can put someone out here. I mean, I could actually do that with um, Signy, and then leap across. That might be a good idea, actually. I would like to put you there. Put you there. Put you there. Finish! Hopefully I'm gonna get some protection from uh, range attacks. We move now, yes? Hmm. Enrage. Yep, I'm gonna use that. And then let them waste a turn. Uh end activation. How is the range on Clement again? I'm gonna go over. Here and command her. Watch this. And then end his activation. Move on up, you 
doomed sons of bees. The time is now. I wonder if I can cross over here, or maybe I should just try to keep uh, these two fronts. Maybe I'll just wait here. Did you have any buff ability? Taunt and blind. Nah, let's just wait. They don't have any ranged abilities, I think. They all have uh, these uh, clubs. So I think we should be fine. And especially if we can, like, block off so they don't all um, surround our people, we should be fine. Turn two. Yes, yes. Now, I could do, like, a pounce. All up in here? Hmm... Nah. I'd be surrounded by these fools. Instead, I'm gonna go... Over here. And do... I could do Massacre. I have five enemies in range. Or... I can just... Hmm. Panicked. No. Let's try Massacre. That softened everyone up, besides the one I intended. Sure. Leave this to me. So that is blocked off from uh, because this guy is standing there. So I think once we can just have him stand there and we're fine. Now. I would like to move over here and shoot this guy in the face. He's weakened. Then move back one. Everyone stay cool. This is a robbery. <laughs> Her armor took care of most of that. That's fine. Let us strike. Let us strike indeed. I could rush on in there. Hmm. For each tile to move through. So if I move one, two, three, four, <clears throat> and um, get on this guy, I should be a hundred percent base damage. Yep. Yeah. Ooh, that was a good hit. A fine hit. And then I would like to uh, end. Now this guy moves on up. Help. help me, you idiots. What does that do? Uh oh, he's trying to surround us. <laughs> but these guys should be blocked off now. <laughs> Which is great for me. Come help me, you idiots. I wonder if that is like a um, activation order buff, sort of? Oh no! The bird flew over the debris! And then left. Oh, no. yes. What a bastard. You know... I'm feeling... A... Urge... Hmm... Why doesn't she have, like, any just normal attacks? I feel like that is something that this game is all, almost missing. Because she almost always, or only has, uh, AoEs. Well, I guess we're pouncing this guy. What is the cooldown on this? Zero. So pounce is fine. But I don't want to attack or damage her. What if I move over here? Can I pounce over this? I can. What is this? Uh, Alright. But that hurts Griffith. I'm gonna pounce on you. Three, seven, or twenty-seven. Cool. Now I'm hoping I can finish this guy. I doubt it. No. But I'll do some damage, which is fine. He's slow, though. And then I will move... No! Oh, I hit the wrong one. Never mind. 
Please stand by while we assassinate you. No, I don't want to stand by while you do that. But I thank you for blocking the path for your friends. And I should be at a good position for a crescent strike, perhaps. If I get over here. I might be able to finish this guy. Crescent strike on you. One down. What about this guy? Oh, he has 46 HP remaining. Now, mm, what is his health? 900. I definitely want him in the front then. So let's m stay here, actually. Ow! My armor took care of most of that. Or all of that. So what does this do? Reinforcements! Oh dang. So I should probably try to kill the guys who did help. Which was one of these two. Oh, I think that we got they got reinforcements. Dang it. That is an issue. We move now, yes? Yes we do. I would like you to pounce. Hmm. Right here. One down? The hunt continues. That was not the guy who uh, called for help. Was it this guy? Might have been that guy. Let's and use Blitz. Hear me roar. And I am gonna maybe pounce once more. Over here. Down you go. That was also not the guy who uh, did the thing, though. So I'm gonna move here. And end. Here we go. Now. Which one is... Uh, that guy is the one who did it, I think. What was it this guy? Now that guy's slowed, but there's no way I can kill this guy in one turn. So might as well just move a bit and bang this guy from behind. You dead. Oh, that was the one. Good, 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 good. And then move over here. So we have no one asking for help now, which is good. What is our turn? It's turn four! They're, I'm probably not gonna get the challenge. <laughs> Most likely not. You little punk. Don't smash her. Let us strike. Mm -mm -mm. Oh, I'm stunned! Dang it. So I can't do anything with him. That is unfortunate. Turn five. And we are definitely not gonna get the challenge bonus. Here we go. I had to uh, do that. Um, uh, get him not to do any um, help. That is the key. But I screwed that up. Let's get over. Actually, I'm gonna have to command you. Can I heal other people? No usable items. I'm gonna have to command you. And then I'm gonna actually stand here and shield her a bit. <laughs> this guy should be a bit damaged. Just a bit. Aha! A fine dodge! Just don't get stunned, Griffith. The time is now. Then we're fine. Oh, I almost have that ready. That would be so good here. Finishing touch. Applies weakened. Hmm. If the target is only 40% health, deal extra damage. What is the cooldown? Four. Also it takes authority, I think. 
What should I do here? Taunt and blind, I think. Yeah. I don't want him killing Signy. So that should make you miss. Good, 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 good. And then... Now, if I do a pounce... That's gonna hurt... My friends. What if I... Pounce over here. She's gonna be in range of all kinds of nastiness though. Which is an issue. So maybe not. And Whirlwind should hit everyone, right? Hmm. I'm gonna go pounce you. <laughs> Done. Signy might actually die. That is a, po a distinct possibility. Yes, yes. Although, what if I do one of these? There's an obstruction in the way. I thought I had a uh, a trinket or a um, skill to undo that. Hmm. What about this? No, that doesn't work either. Well, do this then. And then... We're gonna do a bless. Sisters, hear me roar! And do another pounce. Over... Here. <laughs> what? You dodged it, you son of a bee! I'm gonna use it one once more. So that is also key for these, um... Quick attack... Challenges. How about this? Still an obstruction? You better hit. There we go. Down he goes. And then I'm gonna move on back here. Actually, that was a uh, bit too far. Then, I would like to do... Hmm. I'm gonna put a uh, flag down. To shield her from him, as well as buff us up. And then, end. Oh, What did you take? Did you take my trinkets? Or did you take one of my, uh... Some gold for me? Some Dialac. Either way, not cool. Let's do a Crescent Strike. On you. Huzzah! And we got some shields as well. I love that skill. Now. Do I want to use a blitz on you? I can't really move anywhere. Which is unfortunate. Let's use a blitz. And do a pinpoint strike. Maybe kill one of these guys? No. Maybe that guy could be killed. If I get a good roll. Try it. Nope. But he's under. I guess that's as good as anything. Come help me, you idiot. So this guy used help. We gotta kill him. On the prowl. And can I like swap? No. Because I would like to move K out of the way so I can do a pounce. What about if you go for this guy? Are oh, you dodged it, you son of a bee? Use the blitz. Sisters, hear me roar! And use this. He's thundered. And then maybe move. Oh, I Come on, I keep hitting the uh, end activation instead of movement. But that's fine. 
He's gonna die next time. And then, K, I would like you to maybe shoot this guy in the back. Bang. And then move. Scurry away! Oh, they're running! Oh, maybe I... Oh, it's the eighth turn, maybe. Let's move to kill this guy. This should be a kill. For runner! And then move onwards. We did it! We, move now. we didn't kill them all, but we did it. We got four in Dilek, we got some components, gemstones, and glimmer. Finish. Next, we have a event. We have a campsite. I think we're gonna go to the campsite and rest up. We might need it. Ah! Good, good campsite. What's up, Signy? So many sheep, and cattle, and pigs! <sighs> I really hope none of those are my totem animals. Now it's probably gonna be a majestic beast of some kind. Maybe a dragon. Ready to march. Alright, let's do a save game, and we are gonna leave it there for now. Oh, there we go! If you guys want to see more of this and made it this far, I'd appreciate it if you hit that thumbs up button and share the videos around to get the views up because views make the world go around and I really appreciate it. As always, thank you for watching. I will see you guys next time.